Good evening. When it comes to sports, the town of Gananoque is known for a lot of things. Champions in hockey, fastball, football, and paddling. But one sport in the Thousand Islands that doesn't get proper recognition is fishing. That is, until now. The lure of catching the big one, a huge part of Gananoque's fishing history, and this statue pays tribute to that. This was unbelievable. It's something I'll never forget as long as I live. Uh, November 28th, that uh, date will be embedded in my mind forever. Five o'clock at night when this thing hit, we had no idea what we had until 25 feet back of the boat, she launched right out of the water. That's when we knew we had a record muskie on. McNair's monster muskie is a world record catch. Depending on who you talk to. <laughs> the people in the States, uh, the people from Muskie Hunter magazine and all the magazines and everything in the States are calling it a world record catch and release. No, no questions. To actually have a world record, they say you have to kill a fish. And there's no way I, I would kill a beautiful fish like this. No, you don't have to. Even Mayor Jim Guerra was excited about the catch and especially about the release. I think it's just a great way of sportsmen, truly sports people, sportsmen, uh, making sure there's something here for tomorrow. And uh, something here for the local people, something here for tourists who want to come. Um, there's no downside to this. So it's just, a, I think it's a good example of good citizenship. You can see this is a full replica made of the fish. All you need is measurements and pictures, and they can make the identical fish. You don't have to kill. Um, if a fish like this is killed, the, uh, the breeding, uh, it's not going to happen. The future kids and tourists and everything that are coming through Gananoque, they won't have a chance to catch this fish. Now they do. She's out there still swimming. She's going to be bigger next year. <laughs> and for the record, uh, McNair's muskie was caught in the 40 acres uh, near Gananoque and weighed 65 pounds.